Welcome to another Canadian Security Professionals video tutorial. Today we are going to be showing you how to navigate the doorbell camera wizard. Once you have factory reset the doorbell camera, you will open up your app like this. First thing to do is put your device in airplane mode and then toggle on your Wi-Fi so that the only connection to your phone is through Wi-Fi. Once reconnected to your home Wi-Fi, tap the menu button and then tap on doorbell camera. Once in the doorbell camera section, please tap on the blue plus sign. Tap on the doorbell camera that you've installed at your home. The hardware should have been installed by a CSV tech so you can tap next. If you factory reset your camera properly, it will be flashing green and red. Name your device whatever you desire and then tap next. Now, when this screen comes up, you will go into your phone's Wi-Fi settings to the network that is titled Skybell with a bunch of numbers and or letters after that. Once you have connected to it, your phone may prompt you letting you know that there is no internet with this network. That is fine, we are aware, we just need to ignore it and keep the connection. Once connected to the network, please make sure you toggle back to the Alarm.com app by showing your recently used apps and tapping on the Alarm.com app. This is imperative so the Alarm.com app doesn't lose its place and restart the process. When you switch back to the Alarm.com app, you will scan for networks and choose your home network and enter the password to your home network. Once completed, tap Next. The installation process will now begin. If you complete this process and it fails at 10%, chances are your Wi-Fi password is incorrect. If it fails and it's past the 10% completion mark, you will have to factory reset and begin the pairing process from the beginning. Otherwise, once completed, this will bring your doorbell camera back online. Once completed, tap Next. You can check the view here, and then again, tap Next. Turn on push notifications here, and then tap Next, and then your recording rules. Turn on doorbell calls so that it rings to your phone when the button is pushed. You can turn on motion recording if you would like the camera to record whenever motion is detected, and then tap Next. That is the end of this video. We hope you enjoyed it, and if you get stuck at any point, Please feel free to call us. Thank you for choosing Canadian Security Professionals. 